Good afternoon, everybody. Today is May 17, 2013. These are my soldiers. These are my soldiers. These are my brothers in arms, military veterans, U.S. Army, Navy, Army Air Corps, Marines, Coast Guard. Men who wore a uniform and fought for this country. They died for something. Mayor Bloomberg killed me for something. Mayor Bloomberg killed me for something. He killed me to keep covering up how he railroaded so many people out of public housing, which was a beautiful thing in his slum cleansing operation. I swear it was a beautiful thing. But he had to do it legally, and he had to do it humanely. And he didn't do that. He didn't do that. He didn't do that. So his entire administration and the black mafia of Southeast Queens decided that they were going to put something on me that I couldn't possibly recover from. My job is to make lies out of them. My documentary aired. I'm homeless. I'm homeless. And my stuff coming out in, in newspapers. I've got documentaries airing on TV. And on May 21st, 2013, at 10 p.m., Channel 79 on Time Warner Cable, we make history again. A homeless man airs twice a one-hour political accountability documentary that exposes Congressman Meeks for the black N-word traitor that he is to his conquered race that's in stasis in the United States of America. Yep. Black people ain't going nowhere. Individually, they might, but as a race, they're not going nowhere in this country. They're getting beat by everybody. Everybody. Mexicans come over here, take your jobs, even in the papers. The same way, the large migration of black people down south, why do you think? What do you think? It's not a conspiracy? Of course it is. It just doesn't happen like that. Not, you have the largest migration of black people back down south. Somebody's playing with your housing issue. And start there. It ain't my job to do the rest. But then you got Mexican villages, damn near empty. Why? They don't cross the border. You got about 30 million Mexicans in the United States, about 70 million black people. You got 300 million people in the United States, about 340. So that means white America is about 220 million, on the average, about 200 million. And minorities make a third of the United States. That's a whole lot more than the 13% of just blacks you had. And now those guys don't seem to understand you can't be no smug black idiot anymore. Thinking that you're entitled and white people. That's why y'all get them government jobs because you're still an emancipated slave status. I'm a freeman. I'm going to stay that way. And I'll free you too if you follow me. Every one of these followed somebody and paid a price. I paid the price. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead in the water. I'm done. I'm dead. I am dead. I am dead. I am finished. So they think. <laughs> so they think. But what I'm telling you, bang. I got the big guns on you ready, buddy. I got the big guns on you, man. That's by me getting the feds to take a look into your stuff, New York City, and how you done it, New York City Housing Authority, because I don't think Mr. Obama wants the legacy of being the one that's been busted with his administration. Where wouldn't blacks and Puerto Ricans out of public housing? Democrats won't forgive him for that. <laughs> what? It's my job to tell the truth. Bye-bye.